six centimetres. That'll do. Give an idea of the depth. Well, look, today we're in the middle of January and I'm standing at Traveston Crossing. Now this is Traveston Crossing itself. This is the site of the proposed dam. And just trying to give an idea of the sort of flows that are in the river just here. Um, the river behind me is about 14 metres across and um, flowing through here at the moment is a, just, I'd say, about 90 megalitres a day. Um, there's a stream gauging station just downstream and we can get the accurate figures from there. Um, but we've just done a very quick sort of measurement and, it, and I'd say it's just about just over 90 megalitres a day. Now to put that into perspective, um, I was able to walk over here and the, the deepest the water got was about 15 centimetres. And um, the proposal is to take 150,000 megalitres a year out of the river from this point, which is 410 megalitres a day. And even at stage one, which is much less, um, you're still talking about um, nearly 200 megalitres a day to take out of here and send off and then you've got to get all the evaporative losses and the seepage losses involved in having a dam. Um, this flow here probably wouldn't even cover the um, evaporative losses of the dam at all. And uh, Now this is low for this time of year but this is the sort of flows we've had for about the last seven years. And um, So if we're looking at the typical state of flow in the river, this is the sort of flow in the river in the middle of the wet season at the moment. It's not much of a wet season.